Brian Burnett, your leader. We'll see if he improves. He improves further with a 48. Oh no, he coned it and slowed down. I apologize. It's a 48.412 plus a cone. So no help, in fact. Um, uh, still in the lead, co-driver in that car, Jacob Crow, was still only 34 thousandths back. So we'll wait and see what Jacob Crow is able to do. Uh, hey guys in the solstice, you guys have run the wrong numbers two runs in a row. You've run 71 this time. Um, so please get your numbers right. I'm not sure what's happening there. Uh, the time was a 52.196 plus one cone. 52.196 plus one cone. Uh, Alejandro Paz comes through with a 57.860. 57.860, so no help. You um, will stay in third place spot in SDR. STU number 58, that's Terrence, comes in with a 56.835. No help, he slows down by almost two seconds. All right, Michael Makeda next to finish with a 55.755. That's a strong improvement from Michael for from every run. Uh, really well done. Uh, currently sitting in ninth place in the cam class. 55.755 as we are hoping that this parade of cam in this parade of cam hopefully we get no DNFs we did see uh, Jimmy go through a little bit of an awkward move in that finish sweeper but we haven't gotten a call from the radio so should be clean it is clean. It's a 67.709. No help, though. He's sitting on a 64.0 from a previous run. So no help on time, but it is a clean run. All eyes on Mike rushing, hoping he can stay clean this time. And he manages to go the correct, correct direction where he had been DNFing. Still a few more cones to go, though, so fingers crossed for him. Looks to be doing one more cone. He is through the course clean. Guys, if everyone can give him a round of applause, that would be pretty great. As this is Mike Rushing's first clean run of the day. It is a time of 81.388, 81.388. Good job, Mike. Very well done. Good. And we love seeing improvement. We're glad you're out here. Awesome to see. Next to finish is Kelly Thompson with a time of 59.188. 59.188. He will stay in the fifth position in uh, in the novice class. 